Why, hello there, stranger. My name's Ray Santos. Welcome to Trumbull Valley. Pull up a chair and let me tell you a bit about your new home, huh? Trumbull's had a rough couple of years. Maybe even worse than other places you've been. Did you know that back when things began to fall apart, the whole valley got quarantined? The army built a barricade across the only road out of town, over there by Fairfield. Walled us all in. I heard they were trying to keep the outside world safe from what was going on in here. Didn't make a damn bit of difference, of course. The dead were rising everywhere. Luckily, the wall itself didn't last long, thanks to the work of a few brave folks. In fact, maybe you've heard of one of those go-getters, Lily Ritter? That's right, back before Lily became that big, famous voice on the radio, she lived right here in the valley. Yeah, I watched her dad raise Lily and her brother all on his own. It broke my heart when we lost him during the start of all of this. But that young lady turned out to have more courage than you or I could imagine. Now she runs the whole network, helping total strangers stay alive every day and, well, giving old guys like me a reason to keep going. Of course, every town's got its troublemakers. Ours are the Wilkerson family. They've got a homestead up in the hills and let's just say they don't care much for anyone but themselves. Back in the day, they mostly just ran moonshine, but when the world fell apart, they decided they wanted to run the whole town. They never did pull that off, but even so, they've caused plenty of problems. There aren't many of them left, but trust me, any Wilkerson you meet up with is nothing but trouble. I suppose I should mention the problems we had down in Marshall a few months back. All of downtown got overrun by something really nasty. Whole streets and buildings choked with some kind of, uh, well, I don't have the words for it. You should go see Marshall for yourself when you get a chance. Don't worry, it's not as bad as it used to be. But back then, I thought we might lose the whole valley. We got lucky, I guess. Some smart folks figured out how to save Trumbull. I hear some of them might still be around, keeping busy with something up in Mount Tanner. Yep, Trumbull Valley has taken some hits. But thanks to good folks like you, we're getting stronger every day. Welcome to Trumbull, my friends. I'm glad you're here. <laughs>